Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create a Vertigo effect in Premiere Pro. So on the screen I have Premiere Pro CC 2017, I have two clips, well they're the same clips except this first one, you can see the footage is an aerial footage and it is going backwards. I just duplicated that footage and put it in reverse so then the footage is now coming forwards. So we're going to be working with both, if you have raw footage that looks like this or that looks like this then you can do the vertigo effect. So first of all, with the first footage here where we are moving backwards, what we are gonna do is select the footage and toggle the animation on scale. So from there, you choose uh, how you want, how long you want this effect to last. Now it can be the entire duration, or for me, I'm gonna do it about a second before the video ends. So from here, while still on scale, I'm gonna select this down arrow and simply zoom in. Now you don't want it to be too much if your video is not in high quality because then the footage can look very distort. So I'm going to have it like that. Now if I come back to the start and play this through, you can see that type of effect it is already creating. It's very distorting for the eyes but it turns out really nice. Um, if I zoom in a bit more on this frame I already have. So if I play it through now you'll be able to see a bigger difference compared to the last one just like that it gives a view like that mountain is just growing on you so the next one uh, this time where the footage is coming forwards we're gonna replicate what we just done in the opposite way so select the footage and toggle the animation on scale this time of course the scale is gonna be started higher so on the very first frame I'm gonna have about 170 and then I'm gonna come across just to here and I'm going to set it to zero, so I'm, I mean to 100. If you set it to zero, that's what will happen, so of course you don't want that. The default is actually 100, so 100, there we go, back to normal. And now if I play this through, this is what we have. You can see just like that, as we are zooming in with the raw footage, we are also zooming out on the video. That is how simple it is to create the Vertigo effect in Premiere Pro. I have also done this tutorial in Vegas Pro, so you can check that out in the description.